Is there enough evidence in nature for you to become an atheist? So you believe that there is enough evidence in nature for you to become an atheist? You do believe that a single cell organism, which has very different mechanism of getting its nutrition, and that of taking oxygen, respiration, and excretion, can convert itself to a multicellular organism? So think again. How will a single cell, which develops symbiotic relations with other cells, will understand how to organize itself in the most fruitful way for getting its nutrition, which is transported to each and every cell that constitutes the first multicellular organism? And also how does it learn, to collect its excreta and transport it in a healthy way through its body, and then outside its body? How will it know, how to transfer these characteristics to its progeny? I mean, to develop genes that transfer these very characteristics to its progenies? Which developed first, the multicellular organism, which then transferred its characteristics to genes? and thus develop their own mechanism to repeat the process in its progeny, or is it that the genes understood what codes to develop, which will then be decoded into perfect organisms? A perfect organism, that contains mucus glands in its gastrointestinal tract and genital tract, while no mucus glands in urinary tract? Remember that during embryonic developments, it is called urogenital tract as two systems, genital and urinary are closely related so much, so much, so that if there is an anomaly in genital tract, urinary tract is to be investigated for anomaly, yet the two are different in their mucus secreting property, because mucus is necessary for genital and gastrointestinal tract, while it is dangerous for urinary tract. So this information arose, in the genes of multicellular organism, that they should code for mucus and get tract and not in urinary tract, or is it so happened that mucus happened to be formed in GI tract, and was found to be useful, so genes took the great work of carrying it into progenies? Watch the video. Submitting to God. Animals know that they have been subjugated to humans by God.